Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have an unboxing. It is from Tory Burch and the lighting is really good today as you can see. So I'm really excited to show you guys this bag because it is from the new collection and it is so beautiful and it's a Chanel color. So I'm so stoked to do this video for you guys and share this bag with you and review it and go over it. I have worn it once but this is but this is the official unboxing video and I will be making more review videos about this bag in the future but I did want to wear it once to kind of show you guys or at least tell you guys what my opinion and like what I thought about it as I was wearing it so let's get on with the video you know what time it is all right guys it's time to kick it up a notch with this unboxing today I'm wearing my Strawberry Gucci t-shirt, just some Shein pants, Converse, and a Pac-Man hat. And I really love this outfit. It is very dressed down, but still elevated because of, you know, the luxury t-shirt. So I really like dressing up, but still dressing down. It is definitely so much nicer to be comfortable, guys. So I always say be comfortable in whatever you wear and... Thankfully, luxury t-shirts allow that to be a reality. Now, let's start with this unboxing. Getting on with it, here's the bag. And I went into Tory Burch. I actually reserved, had the bag held for me. I'm having a difficult time talking to it. I don't know what's going on. I have allergies still. So the bag is really beautiful. And I love how they packaged it. So you have the tissue paper right here and then this box on the inside I'm going to take out because it is gorgeous and I think this is a very beautiful print I would actually buy something in this print but I haven't seen too many things so this is what it looks like a little parcel and I have my proof of purchase in here I'm going to share this with you guys as well so the receipt comes like this and I think it's important to share how much it was because I think that this was a very good price. So this is the small Kira shoulder bag and it was $5.48 before tax. And I do not have many Tory Burch bags. I have two tote bags and I think that's it. Mostly by ready to wear from Tory Burch. But now let's open it up. It has Velcro. And then on the inside, it has this beautiful pop of yellow. And here's the bag. Okay, so here's the bag. Sorry for the allergies. And on the dust bag, it says Tory Burch. Very pretty. Just a basic dust bag. But honestly, it's, it's the same quality as like a Gucci dust bag. Oh my gosh, are you guys ready for this? Here is the pop of color. <laughs> This bag is amazing. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna be making many videos about this bag, but let's just do a tour of the bag first. So you have the T on the front and it is showing up as the true color, thankfully. This is a Tiffany powder blue. It has the option of shoulder. I'm gonna have to fix that in a second. So shoulder option or crossbody. This is what crossbody looks like. And I will also do a, a video of me in the mirror so you guys can see a full crossbody. But I also want to do a tour of the bag before I start talking about it in depth. So this is a very beautiful leather. It is sensitive, so it will get dirty. Um, I really think that this is high quality leather. It's not dry like one of the other bags I got from online, but I think it was like a factory type of defect. It was just sitting for too long in the wrong conditions. No feet on the bottom, magnetic closure. And then on the inside, it is very spacious. It has a back zipper compartment stuffing. Here's the tag. And let me get this way. I like how it has two pockets right here and my phone actually fits in these pockets. Very spacious on the inside. It says Tory Burch right there. And then it has a deep zipper pocket. So 
This fits all of my stuff. I'm going to make a what's in my bag video later because I can't have this video be super, super long, but I am just obsessed with how practical this bag is. Very easy to close it. And this is what it looks like on the shoulder. I think that this gives a very alternative vibe with the silver hardware. I do like their gold hardware, but gold hardware is just not my preference. It's not for me. And I'm gonna make a video coming up that explains why I believe this is better than the Chanel Coco handle. And this is a Chanel color that they have either discontinued or they're not bringing out very often. They're being very stingy with this color, guys. Very stingy with this Tiffany powder blue. So I think this is great because this is affordable luxury. It is a contemporary designer. However, this does look similar to a Chanel bag. And I think that for the price, that this is totally worth it. I can wear this bag and not feel like I might ruin it or I might not get my cost per wear. This is a very affordable, attainable bag. And I think that taking the stress out of owning a lighter colored bag and having it be a little bit less for the price is so important because this is more carefree now and I'm just so excited to have this in my collection. Here is in the mirror. So this is just on the shoulder. I do like it this way, but I think I prefer it crossbody. This is what it looks like crossbody. It falls at just the right point right on your hip. Now, if you are shorter, it might be a little bit different but I think that this is a really great length. And I think that they have definitely, Tory Burch has outdone Chanel when it comes to functionality and practicality. On the shoulder, so just very comfortable. Again, very practical. I really love the vibe of this bag. I think that it is incredibly, again, practical, functional, beautiful, just, Across the board, a really great bag. And I would probably get this in black now that I've seen it in this blue color. I do like the so black look of the Kira, but honestly, I think I just really like the silver hardware the best. All right, guys, that was my video. Comment below if you love this bag. Comment below if you've ever seen this bag. I had never seen this collection before and I'm constantly on Tori Birch's website like at least once a week. And I am just so happy to have gotten this. This was actually a bag that many people were after in the boutique and several people called about it when it was on hold for me. And then someone came in and saw it and they were like, oh, I wanted to get that bag. So I definitely lucked out and I didn't want to buy it online because I wasn't sure if it would come damaged or because I live in Texas, I wasn't sure if the conditions like the heat would damage it in shipping. I knew that the boutique was going to have a very good quality bag that wasn't damaged. Make sure you give me a thumbs up and you subscribe if you like content like this and comment again if you absolutely love this bag. If you're going to go buy this bag. Hope you guys have a great day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.